Hello, FreePlot here, and welcome to a tutorial on how to add audio to your Flash animation in Adobe Flash CS6. Uh, this will probably work for other versions of uh, Flash 2, so uh, yeah, but I'm using uh, CS6 in this case. So let's just make a tidy little animation and add some audio to it. So let's just make uh, some uh, beautiful guy here and uh, give him a little mouth and make a little cute head okay that's not so cute that's that's super cute and give him some hands there we go and a little body there we go beautiful just beautiful I'm gonna make his eyes uh, red okay there we go and actually some nipples so now we're just going to record a sound in audacity now audacity is a free recording uh, software where you can record uh, your microphone so uh, I'll add a, a link in the description so you can download it now let's just make a little recording okay that's beautiful whoops let's just listen to that Okay, that's uh, very nice. So let's just export that uh, by hitting the export button. Uh, it's uh, Norwegian for me, but uh, just ignore that. <laughs> you can just press Control Shift E like this. Now I'll just put it on the desktop. I'll call it, and I'll save it as a wave file because wave files are nice. Just hit OK, and then go back to Flash. Uh, and just open up your desktop folder and find your uh, file and just drag it in to flash now it says preparing to import and then when it's uh, finished you just hit the library button here and it should be nicely placed here now um, go to the layer beneath your drawing um, or if you don't have a layer there then just make a new layer like this hit the new layer button and uh, put it under it doesn't have to be under but I like to keep it under because uh, it's like nice and hidden so then you just grab the audio and drag it on the stage it doesn't matter where just drag it on and now there's a tiny little blue stripe on that layer which means that uh, just for one tiny frame uh, there's audio so let's just extend that so I'm just going to mark a uh, little portion there and hit F5 on your keyboard like this and just hit it a couple of times until you see the little blue line stops and that's where you can just mark the rest of the frames and uh, remove the frames so now let's look at this very nice I'm just gonna take the audio up on flash a little bit there we go now one very important thing um, I have already done this but if you haven't then it's very important you do this um, when you hit the um, layer where your audio is on the frames and you look at properties and here in the sound panel um, on sync if it's set to event or start or stop then that's wrong immediately fix that to stream this means that you can <laughs> scroll through and listen to each sounded individually um, so if, it, if it's set to event you can't do that then it just plays once and if you stop the animation then it keeps playing so that's real annoying so keep, always always keep the stream now let's just um, I'm going to just make him do a tiny little nice expression here so I'm just gonna draw the next frame like this draw a little mouth some teeth fill it in make his head again really uh, <laughs> potato shaped and like this beautiful I've never made anything this good before and also his eyes are going to be red and one more thing uh, you can go back and forth between frames if you hit the comma button or um, period button on your keyboard so that's very convenient so yeah 
I'm just gonna finish up this animation very quickly here. Make him do a bunch of uh, weird expressions. So let's look at this. Okay, that's that's just beautiful. I uh, never made anything this good before. Um, hopefully I win a Grammy award or Emmy award or something for this. Now, let's add some music. Now, I would suggest going to youtube.com slash ericarchive. Very, very nice uh, loyalty-free music here. Which means that if you use it in uh, your videos, you are able to monetize it. And uh, YouTube won't uh, delete the video and all that because of copyright. So let's just find a song here. Okay, that works. Um, so in the description here, just find a download link and hit that. Now let's uh, make that a download. <laughs> winner winner dot mp3. Just beautiful. Now we wait and we wait and we wait and we. W okay, it's done. Um, so let's just find it and drag it into Flash, just like we did the last time. Um, yeah, there's a, uh, okay, my PC is going apeshit, um, could not import, okay, uh, give me one sec, guys, if you get the problem where you can't import uh, an audio file because it's mp3 or something, then just drag it into Audacity, um, and then export it again as a WAV file, because WAV files are better than MP3 files. Now we can import it. So just find uh, your music or whatever. And uh, here it is, now it works because it's a WAV file. And let's put it under the voice. So let's look at this. Okay, that's, that's, uh, that's, uh, that's art. Um, I think I just gotta make the audio a little bit lower. There we go. Okay, that's beautiful. Now, if you hit Control Enter, you might encounter a little problem. Just one second, I'm getting messages there. Um, Control Enter. Yeah, there's a problem where the audio is really low quality, and this is very important that you fix before you export. So go to File and Publish Settings, and here you see the uh, the little thing where it says Audio Stream. Hit that, and it's set to 16 g g something by default. Just put at that at like almost the top or the best or whatever. Yeah, and also quality should not be set to fast, but the best. And hit OK. Now if you hit Control enter Yeah, the, the quality is very nice and high quality and all that. So yeah, that's basically it. Um, yeah, now we know how to add audio to your Flash animation. And this tutorial will turn out longer than I expected, so thank you for watching and subscribe! See you later!